Fellow warriors, how's going? This is Kesson. Welcome back to The Mummy Returns. Now, we are in Egypt. Yes. So, we finished the tutorial. We literally got nothing back from the first uh, level. All we're gonna do now is wait for the train. As you can see, we got our allies here. Yeah, those are emotive servers, but guess what? We can literally kill them. That that's how loyal they are. They literally themselves get killed. And we can literally steal their weapons. Some of them got firearms, but like I said, firearms uh doesn't really work with Emotep because you can't use them. The train is not yet here. Come back when night falls. And we will make our way to Karnak. So the, the train uh, to Karnak has not arrived yet. I literally cannot believe it, really. That he needs a train. He's powerful. He's the mummy and he needs a damn train. Can you believe it? I can li literally, guys. It's a bit silly if you think. Because, you know... And like now we need to we need to to stand with the rules with the rules of of the modern world. There'll also be uh, innocent people. They will literally be uh, our. How can I say? I'll save them for later because now no point killing them. We got two. And voila. See, they're just like walking peacefully, but we can kill them. Even to the Magi, it's common attack us. They, 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 they just won't run. They just stand there and see all happy. Are you sure we are not, uh, I don't know, in Thailand? Because these, these people are like, they practice Buddhism or something. They, they look too calm to me. So yeah, what we gotta do is wait for a train, which means we just gotta go around uh, and kill people. Did I mention already that I, I apply- Oh yeah, the cats! The cats! The cats sense evil. They're like uh, Egypt guardians. But unfortunately, I had to kill the cat. Oh my god, no, it sucks. Can I restore the cat? No, I can't. I can't restore the cat. Too bad. So, did I mention already that I have put the white the white screen patch on this game? Some of you might have noticed the the white screen patch has been applied. On the first episode, I didn't have a white screen patch, but on this one, yes, I do have a white screen patch. Some people might think uh, white screen patch is not that good. Uh, I prefer the thickness, the thickness of the game. But personally, I think that some games are good with a white screen patch and some are, are not. For example, the first episode looked quite good on a, with, without a white screen patch, but I, oh, it looks better. So the mummy can it can be alright without a white screen patch. It can be playable. It doesn't look bad, but obviously now it looks so much better. This is the problem with PS2 emulators. They need uh, some games need uh, you need to, to download a white screen patch because many don't have it. So that's the problem. And yeah, we don't like ever certain goal with this. Like I say, all we gotta do is literally go around and kill. Oh, uh, it sucks killing cats, but seriously, they, they, they really are annoying. I'm sorry, kitty kitty. Oh, again, where I kill cats. I know probably, probably now people will stop watching this video or this entire let's play because I kill cats, but I have no choice. They're too annoying. So please do not stop watching my let's play or uh, anything. Don't dislike the video because they, look, they are evil cats in this, as you can see. They're not normal, like, like domestic cats. They're evil cats, okay? See, they, they don't look... That, do you guys think that a normal cat can do this? It's not a normal cat. See, the, the, even the way it sounds, this kitty. 
sounds uh, a bit weird. That's the proof that it's not a kitty. It's like a secret guardian. A very secret guardian indeed. A mummy hunter cat, basically. Or evil hunter. Because Emotep is evil. But remember guys, we are playing as the evil. So it's obvious that we will kill the good guys. So... That's how it is. Like... We are evil. This game doesn't have like a difficulty option, however... It's like... Rick O'Connor, it's uh, hard. And Emotep is easy. Because literally, Emotep is easy. But Rick O'Connor is quite hard. It's really not easy playing as Rick O'Connor. This is why I'm kind of a little bit scared to play uh, Rick O'Connor's story. Because his story is really, really hard, guys. It's really hard. So really, I really hope I'm gonna do fine when I play story. Ooh, that's a beautiful place. Who lives here? The mayor. Hello, Mr. Mayor. I am, well, I used to live here like uh, a thousand years ago. I see this place has changed a little. Egypt, my, my home, my homeland. Let's change to, I don't know, to the to the best, I guess. Seriously, it was a very nice place. Open to the public too. <laughs> Who's here? More magis. But yeah, remember we gotta kill every magis. Then I think once we kill them all, we can go to the train and then the train will arrive. Then it'll be like a night session, I think. There will be this this level will be like in two sessions, morning and, and night. If if I'm correct, I might be wrong, but that's what I remember at least. So is this is like an hotel, right? What is this? There's more enemies. Yeah, I can hear the footstep. So we, we, we gotta keep looking for enemies. We got a compass. I think the compass is supposed to tell us where the enemies are? I don't know. Oh, there! I don't know what this damn compass is supposed to, to tell you. Like, we I know it's supposed to tell you where you're supposed to go. However, to complete this... Wait, what? So I could see through the screen. There is a Magi. Who is it? <laughs> You're gonna be kidding me! Oh my god! Okay, that was that was hilarious! You knocked the door! Who is it? Your arch enemy, bro! <laughs> Who is it? Really? What are we doing anyway in this room? With a bed, especially. Mmm, dirty Magi. Who is it? I'm here to absorb your soul. The Americans are not here, but a canopic jar is. <laughs> a canopic jar the Magi wanted very badly to keep from me. The curse of death. Night has fallen. The Americans will have to wait. I have to get back to the train. I don't remember what this curse of death does. Okay, so that was the, the goal. Okay. So the goal was to kill every enemy. But it was just to knock the door. So what does he do? This dead. Uh, I wish to know, but I wish I could like watch it tour, like read read it again, but uh I had to test it. Wait, I lost all my items again. That's the problem with this game. You you keep losing items every new every session. It's kinda stupid. So what does he do? You won't shoot enemies. Like if he can do it already, right? It's a bit useless to be honest. I don't know guys, it's you I, I bet you, you have to stun. You need to stun uh, the enemy. 
for this to work. But it's kind of pointless, really, this, this spell. Because you can use this. And he heals you. Why would you use the curse of death? Okay, that's a bit stupid now. Uh, what did they not think? That it will be useless. Oh my god, it really firearm they do lots of damage. They really are OP. Okay. We need to be careful when you get hit by a gun because this really hurt a lot. Honestly, they hurt like shit. What the fuck, man? Damage insane. Ah. Oh. There. See, tell me, why should I use the Curse of Death again? So pointless. Like... Freaking pointless. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> you need to kick the... You know what? Fuck off. I'm moving out. I'm gonna kill this dude. I know... What? Easy. I know he's in... What is Ronnie? <laughs> there. I know he's innocent, but I don't give a shit. Think your health is... Good looking on me, not you. Oh my god, those firearms are annoying as hell. I got a bunch of kitties after me, by the way. And Magi's. Magi's and kitties are after me. No, 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 definitely the guns and they, they need to die. We can probably ignore the, the swords. The swords, man. But not the... The fire, the guns, the guns, dudes. If it's, you know, really, the, the guns, we just can't avoid them. They're too OP. Because you guys seen the damage they do, right? Uh, what part, what part? Where do I have to go? I got this crappy map. Yeah, this is the map. I mean, are you kidding me? That's the map. A bit shit, isn't it? No, honestly, the map of, the, of that game is of this game is quite bad. It's one of the worst maps I ever seen. Like really. Okay, I wonder where do I have to go now? Mm. Think here, maybe. Ugh. Obviously, when you play as Rick, the cats will not hurt you. Like, you do not have to worry about that because Rick, Rick O'Connell is not evil. So, obviously, the cats. Oh my god, they're really annoying. So, how can you not know, kill them? Okay, after a bit, you'll start eating on them. Once they, they keep eating you non-stop. You will literally start eating them. Where is the fucking way here? Can you believe it? I'm lost. If only the map was a little bit better in this game, then... Oh, God. Oh, definitely no. Wow, how many cats there are? Kick the cat! <laughs> I can't believe it. Can you even kick a cat? The powerful emotif can... Like, really? This guy, he needs to produce some Kung Fu. Like, he literally need to, need to produce some martial arts or something. Because here, cakes are like sh dog shit. Okay, maybe if we go up here, we might have a better view. Let's see where can we go. Maybe here. Hmm... I know I should probably try to consult the map, but the map is like very bad. I can't really understand the map here. Okay, I, th I think he, this is the way. Yeah, that's the way. That, that asked, yeah, that's the way indeed. 
Uh, then there. I suppose. Yeah, I think it's thing going the right way. I think. Maybe I should console the map. Eventures. Uh, okay. Let's try to go here. Or no? No, 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 not sure. Let's, let's go here instead. You can get lost easily in this game. Some maps can be, can be very annoying, like this one. Where you can literally, can, you can never find a way. Ugh. And the stamp cat. Uh, but that's what you get for playing as Emotep. That's what you get, I'm afraid. Okay, the more Magi's we encounter, the better, because it means we are going on the correct way. I think. Oh, this... Have I been here? Yeah, I've been here. See, I don't know why I always end up going back. For some reason. I know that the, the red hair is where the... Um, where the train is. I'm sure of that. Okay. Sorry, but I need to keep looking for this damn map because really... I never used to look at the map when I was a kid, but now... I'm, I'm struggling a little bit, a little bit more. For some reason. Maybe I should just follow the compass. Okay. Away. Okay, you know what? Let's start to follow the compass. Let's see if he leads us to the to the correct way. Yeah, but the compass, dude, is not really doing an amazing job. Maybe following a compass might be, even be worse, not gonna lie. Oh, this is proper bad. Proper, proper bat. Oh, oh my god. Oh, there's something there. Let's get it. How do we get there, though? I know it's just a temporary item. We not... I think I'm going on the wrong way. Yeah, I am definitely going on the wrong way. That's definitely the wrong way. What a fucking labyrinth. Is Egypt really like this? If Egypt is like this, I never want to go. Because it's, it's so damn confusing. Because every hero looks damn the same. Pretty sure I go near too. Yes, this is the, the same pattern. I'm taking the same that all the time but for some reason I keep go get going back from the start I don't know why I literally don't know why this is happening really I think I might have got it I think I got it guys I think I got it oh perfect I got it I got it okay that took me a while I don't know why honestly that was quite annoying, but we did it. Now let's get a train. Let's ignore all these pieces of shits. Even though I might need some health. I'm gonna be on full health. Wasn't any point to call like that. 
that amulet that was there because it's just a temporary boost. So who really cares? I don't know if the level will finish as soon as we get the train though. We might um like not sure, yeah. Wait, stop the train! Batem Sumata. Goodbye, Bajai. The train is about to leave the station, my lord. If you can just hold off the Magi a few moments longer. Time to die, Magi. I don't get it. Emotep is powerful. Why can't he not just like stop the damn train? Oh yeah, we gotta like we gotta like wait uh, for it for it for a time to expire so we we, we death it. Oh my god. What why can I why can I just I can uh, What? Oh, okay. I don't know why I couldn't before. It, it won't let me. That was weird as, as hell. He just won't let me. We can, we can just like go run around, to be honest. We can do this. Yeah, that's what we can do. Wow, is, is that OP Emotev? Even with punches, he kill he kills people. That's OP he is, really, guys. I keep I keep telling you, emotive is like easy mode. I wish I could play at the at the Magi leader. He would have been cool if it was a secret card, but no, he's not. I'm just gonna tell you now, he is not a secret card, unfortunately. Which is sucks really because he looks pretty cool even to play as. But no, they did not make a secret story of it or anything. Excellent. We are on our way to the Golden Pyramid. <sighs> your powers will know no bounds, my lord. Not when we have defeated the Scorpion King. And soon I will restore your true soul. And my beloved Anux on the moon will return to me. Having reduced the city of Cairo to a den of decay, Imhotep leaves with Mila toward Karnak, still possessing Alex, despite Ardeth's attempt to recover him once more. Focusing his immediate attention on the task at hand, the mummy looks forward only to resuscitating his true love, Anaxunamun and restoring her eternal spirit to Mila's body, for Mila is her reincarnated form. It won't be long before the two are together once more. The time has come for my beloved to return to me. The soul of Anux and the moon will be restored, and our love will have endured a thousand years' time. Everything we need is in the temple. Come, my love. Come, my love. Okay, can I just say though, I do remember this level at all. At all, honestly, I don't remember it. it. Reminds me of something from Tomb Raider: The Last Revelation, but yeah, yeah, because it's Egypt. So Tomb Raider 4 is also based in Egypt. It reminds me also of Tomb Raider. Whoever played Tomb Raider: Last Revelation can, does know what I'm talking about. But okay, follow orders. So I guess this is everything for now, and I'll catch you guys to the next episode. Thanks again for watching an episode of The Mummy Returns. And I hope you guys can consider becoming a member of my channel to access exclusive perks, watching video previews and exclusive let's play as a Muso member or Ultimate member. And I'll see you guys soon to the next episode. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, subscribe to my girlfriend, and see you guys soon.
to the next episode. Take care.